Welcome back, guys, to Atelier Riser 3, Alchemist of the End and the Secret Key. Well, last episode, with Patty added to the party, we started to quest around 4A. As after finding three treasures in Dian's treasure hunting and giving Romy some developmental goods, we made some rose perfume for Tao and a desalinator for Kirken Island, as well as a golden axe for ourselves. With Macefish also handed over to complete sympathy among countrymen, we now continue on. Right, we're going to the Ruins of Nemed, so a journey is about to begin. We've done a lot of alchemy and synthesis at this point in time. I kind of wonder if we could just go back to the shop and buy loads of Goldatarian again before we set out. Yeah, from now on, I think it's going to be a good idea for me to upgrade. Where's Romy? Oh, sell me some more. My gathering capabilities. Though I do obviously want more of the... Oh my god, you could just keep coming back here and buying this. That's... I now really have a super use for my money. And I can obviously upgrade more tools at this point in time. I'm pretty sure I can upgrade a fishing rod. It's gonna be silly. Right then, so we're going upwards. So first of all, there's another character quest on the way. Let's go. Oh, I say that. Which way's... Can you go out this way? No? <laughs> I can check this. Why had no entry to the ruins? Oh, why thank you. Not that I've done many of these at this point in time, but still. It is strictly forbidden for anyone other than Gleaners to enter the ruins of Nemed without permission. This is a rule for the safety of the village and to protect its future, and those who violate this rule will be dealt with accordingly. There it is. But I'm, a, I'm gleaning now. It's all good. Off we go. Ooh, can I get anything new off these now? Yeah, apart from getting Gold Eterion anyway, which is Golden Knight, sorry. More of the good stuff. I don't even feel I'm getting good stuff from them. There's another blue one just appeared. I take its place. I have a lot of red ore by the end of this. Right. Landmarks, by the look of it, is something we need to get. I have to worry about the poisonous plants. I'm sure I can synthesize an antidote. So there is a character event. Just over here. Hello, bunny. You can take me away from the character event now. It's mean of you, Bundy. You can take me into some horrible monster that's just going to bash me horribly. Uni starfish. Where'd he go? We went around the corner. You're taking me to it? Thanks, bunny. Very kind of you, I guess. Wait a sec. Come take a look, everyone. Wow, they're eggs. Lots of eggs. What kind are these? Looks like they're a bunch of different ones. Looks like bird eggs. You get some migrating birds here, too. Wow. I guess this is where they will put their eggs. Funny that there are some other ones mixed in here and there, though. Is it all snakes or something? Nothing too sketchy. Still, with all of these, we can make all kinds of dishes. What should we make? I know a few decent recipes. 
You know, while I was on my training journey, I always ate raw eggs. Wait, it's just raw? Please, Len, at least cook them. Too much of a hassle. Plus, you never know when you'll get attacked. There's no time to cook. I do understand that. But at least try to act civilized. Still though, cooked or raw, everything's all the same once it's in your stomach. Besides, I don't have any cookware. You know, at the start, I did try. I break eggs onto the flat of my sword and fry them over a fire. That kind of thing. <laughs> but it's a pain. It gets the sword dirty, and it doesn't taste that good. So I thought, to hell with it, I'll eat them raw. I don't know whether to call it crass or wild. I wonder if all fighters are like this. Oh, I'm under attack. That's fine though, I get to switch. It's Patty! I see the other targets the one I need to worry about though. Oh, you're not allowed to move. Her Sakura Blossom Strike, say. Well, I can get giant bird feathers from here now. Thanks to my third tier of gathering, so I'll take that. Right then, in this dead end, is there a treasure chest? It's very dark. I mean, I could just jump down. Yes. Kind of had to be, didn't there? With some clean water in it. <laughs> Alright, with that character event done, let's move on to our next quest destination. The fact that these are either or of Bree Stones and Degenesis Stones at this point does make me curious. Ooh, that's how we get the Amber Oil. Amber Oil is great. Seems to always have a free elemental value or most of the time have that. And I don't have many spirit isopods, so getting some of that is good. I should probably look to upgrade this hammer ASAP then. And a fluffy sheep for two gold coins. Don't need to do that. Slightly curious about the water that's down here though. It's more ancient blue water. New glittering sand is down here. Don't know what I need more of, because now that I can just buy Goldatarian, do I really need to get Goldenite? If you understand my thought process there. Onwards. Maybe we'll come across one of those king apples or whatever they are soon. 
Sa Sam leaves a sharp. I must not cut my fingers, supposedly. Oh, don't attack me. I need to find out if I can get, like, gold noonies or something. That thing's gonna be dead before I attack it, surely. Oh no, maybe not. Okay, stay there. I said stay. It doesn't really seem at the moment that I can get too much in the way of great new materials. With that golden axe, but uh, I guess we just wait for the future. This looks interesting. There's battle equipment everywhere. Look, it's just like it was when they left it. Getting worked up again. Um, might be getting worked up a little bit, sure. How often do you find a ruin this big? Alright, where do we start our search? Over there. There are the remains of a big cannon. Let's go. Alright, alright, we're going. Can you tell something based on these remains? Tao does this a lot. Even the smallest hint won't escape him. Ah, yes, this is... T Tao, wait! What do you mean? I was just about to... I guess I was a bit too focused. We'll need to deal with this before we can search properly. Yeah, let's go. It's just a sheep. Ow! How dare you attack me. Gotta keep our guards up, huh? Now then, Tao, it seemed like you had just worked something out. Ah, uh, yeah, I found some info regarding a weapons cache. Apparently, the people of the time made a formidable fortress to store weapons. Initially, it was meant to store precious goods, but at some point, its purpose changed. To what? Don't know yet. It was a state of emergency, so I wouldn't expect a super detailed account. So, we kind of know, but we kind of don't know. Ah, that's half the fun of exploring ruins. Guess it is. The front gate ruins. I was going to say, like, the architecture looks a bit different. <laughs> Investigating the scars of war. A new quest has been obtained. Quest has also been completed to give us 300 more SP. For none of the effort. I like it. I totally agree. these ever give anything that great? Maybe I need, like, it with certain properties. There are better ways to get better keys, obviously. Or just to make keys that are better. Oh, I need this badly. More Queen Spiderweb. I've been running out of that. These are the ruins of Nemed. Wow. This could be older than the stuff close to the capital, not to mention the Clint Kingdom. Like a fish to water. I hope he hasn't forgotten our purpose here. Is that rare? Looks like the same old boring view. How come the people who were capable of building such massive structures no longer living here? Are no longer. The reason is unknown, but cities of the age of God rarely remain and flourish into later generations, and almost always fall to ruin. I'm sure I've studied this. 
In this case, the reason for the destruction could be a foreign enemy, internal conflict, disaster, or the gate itself. You mean like the king of the Felucia came out of the gate? That was just one of them. So we managed on our own. But the truth is that a tremendous horde overflowed from the gate and... The invasion, trampling everything into a mess, is the most dangerous. Lent, what do you think? This looks like the remains of a siege. Does that mean there was an attack from the outside? Sorry, I need to search the inside before I decide anything. Felucia and a gate. So what we heard in Miss Ryza's stories could really exist. What do you mean? I should explain to you too, Dian. But it's gonna be long. So I'll tell you more once we get back. We've only seen it from the outside. It's too early to make any judgments. You're right. Let's head inside already. Could this be open with your key, Riser? I'll try. Ah, it's no good. Nothing's happening. What is that thing? It's Riser's trump card. I don't know why. It doesn't seem to work. That's a broken castle wall to the east. We usually go in from there. Then let's try heading over there. Alright, come with me. We have to take the long way around then. That's a bit of a pain. It's not opening. Nothing we can do about that. And it bothers me. Bothers me that you think it will just work on every single door that exists, to be totally honest with you. <laughs> I don't think it would, or should. I don't know why you do. Right, these dark crystal fragments, there's something that I'm pretty sure I need more of. Random quest triggered. It's to kill a boss, so let's see if it's gives SP. Flare puny, come here. My bestest best friend. First of all, I need to use that because people are actually losing health here. Anyone remaining? And there be several rows of them, eh? I need to use that again to start getting people's health up. People losing HP time to make some more armor. I don't think we need to worry just yet. But I mean, we do have a new armor material on the thing. That might be more makeable than puny leather. Federica. 
More items. Debuffs. I hit for a little bit more. Instantly regenerated the damage, though. Okay, I kind of thought that would be enough. Seems I'm only at a four-hit combo. Oh, I can fatal drive. This is my fatal drive. <laughs> Still not dead yet. <laughs> oh, I was really honestly going to use a fatal drive as well. <laughs> That's a big puny at the end, so hopefully I'll get a big puny thing. Like some more puny level in the future. <laughs> You've got the lowest attack in our group currently. Rise has got more. Patty's got more. Well, 200 extra SP. We even got the see you later reward as well. We could even use a pristine key here. Ooh. A winky. Got the adventure effect, so that's not bad. Seven uses of door opening is pretty good by me. So, uh, it's probably safe. We've got to head east, though, supposedly. Which is not this way. But there's stuff that way, and the quest is a long way away. So should we take a detour for now? The main quest calls, granted. <laughs> but we are exploring Nemed 2. Ooh, hammer. Mystic Sphere. Oh, these drop something new with an X. Fertile soil. You can't catch me. I can run away. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I was trying so hard as well. Just watch this guy absolutely take my guy's health down. A little surprising. Like, Dean's not having a good day here. Yeah? Poison. Don't die, Dean! Dean! I need to make something that revives people. Seems poison's quite deadly. We were careless, I guess. Well, at least you're 1 HP. We're fine to keep going, but actually we're not. My basket's almost full. Oh, 
Please wait for me, everyone. Are you okay, Federica? I'm sorry for slowing you down. Are you okay? Let's rest a little here. I can't believe how much stamina everyone has. I run out of breath so quickly. Well, we grew up in the country. Running around from when we were young. Hey, don't bundle me in with the rest of you. You've just always been troublesome kids. That is from the capital. And she keeps up with you. I've trained in swordsmanship and gone through ruins with Mr. Tao in the past, so... You might be from the capital, but you've seen more training than most. More or less. Even so, I often feel that keeping up with this crowd is hard. I feel like you just said something terrible about us. No, maybe a slightly bad review. I don't know. There's another web here. Yeah, <laughs> I saw it in the cutscene. I was like, oh, I'll have that. <laughs> it's weird how you can react to things like that. That's mine then. Fine. Yeah, we are out of material space. So the question is, is there, do we continue on? Or do we walk back? I think we're nearer the next place than not, though. So... With that in mind... I will take those two. A random quest has been triggered again. I really want this. My basket is full. Sure. Oh, okay, we don't actually need these. <laughs> Even though they had lots of plus pluses on them. It's a cat. What do you want, random quest person? The alchemist, right? There's something I would like you to make. I need this, but is it possible to get it? I'd be very grateful. It's never down here. Deliver cloth. You just need one cloth. Why would I give you this? Do I get an extra reward if I do? Is that what that's saying? Give you some of my, my crappiest cloth. You got it for me, thanks. My way of saying thank you. Take it. Don't be shy. It's just quality over 60. We got 1,000 coal for that. That was not worth. <laughs> Stroking a cat was totally worth. He keeps trying to give me decayed iron all the time. <gasps> Super spider web. Oh, there's a settlement here. It's very different from the village of Fare. Or Fore, sorry. Huh? It seems like there's a dispute going on. Hello, is there something wrong? You're a traveller. I would welcome you, but with the way things are. You see, we had a mine, but several days ago, a monster started appearing there. I see. From what I can tell, you work with ores, so I can see how that would be a serious problem. Exactly. We have to do something about the monsters so we can go collect ore. Sounds like something we could take care of. We'll take them out quick. You will. Would you mind doing that for us? Please do be careful. Or it is then. Get rid of the lowest quality thing take the good stuff. Right, well, because we've got this landmark now, we can quickly walk back to drop all my stuff off at the atelier. And I did actually want to do some synthesis again, to be perfectly honest with you, because of what we got going, but the village between mountains needs help. So let's help this village indeed. So down here? Nope. It's hopeless. I can't do it by myself. What a shame. If only I was stronger. They're all ruining everything. And so I start just collecting materials instantly and going... 
by the webs. I think I'm going to get a character quest before I can deal with the monsters. No, nope, I managed to dodge it. So it's... Here? How can I stay silent on this any longer? This is a new quest. What's wrong? I'm lamenting the sad state of this village. Uh, yeah? Just imagine this for a moment, would you? Every single day. Nothing but lamb and herb soup. It's easy to get, so that's all we eat. This goes on, I'm going to lose my mind. You get it, right? Uh, I don't really. I just want some seafood occasionally. The merchants don't bother coming here to sell it. You, you're an adventurer, right? Then can I ask something of you? We might to bring you some seafood. Yes, please blow the crisp ocean breeze into our village. Well, I obviously have it already, right? I can almost smell the sea. I don't have any items that can be given. That is surprising. All right, we'll check what we need to give for that in a second. Once we've dealt with the quest. Which is... There. Right, are you going to beat the crap out of me? I don't know. We're about to find out. Kind of need a res thing, really. Hello. I'm jumping in front of you. <laughs> Before I hit you upside the head with an axe. I see we're fighting multiple enemies again, and Patricia's already taking damage. Paddy? I'm trying to switch to Paddy to get her out of there. But I can't. We're not on the run. We're fine. The end's getting beaten the crap out of now. The end, stop dying. Stop that, Dian! Stop that! Well, that was going for me. That was. They do hit for a bit. Oh, we've got regen and defense up. Just about got around there, didn't we? Maybe I do need to make a new super armor. <laughs> ah, we survived, and that's all that really matters. The side quests are more deadly than the main quest, is basically what we know. <laughs> After all, there's no way to tell, like, at uh, what point in time you're really supposed to do it. <laughs> you just do it, and then you go, ah! Oh. Yes. <laughs> that has not ended how I wished it to. <laughs> We're back! We defeated the monsters near the ore. We should be able to come and go freely now, and you can resume quarrying. R really? What kind and strong adventurers you are. I have no idea if this is useful to you, but please, help yourself to ore whenever you want. Really? You mean it? You bet. How can we refuse? Not to brag, but the ores from these parts are pretty valuable. They're coveted by many. Thank you so much. I'll help myself and then pop it into the cauldron. <laughs> you always have recipes on the go. Mana of ore. 